Brother, I don't tell you, say, I don't tell you for Niger. <laughs> Brother, I don't tell you, say, me, I don't tell you for Niger. He <laughs> don't tell when me tell you for Niger. <laughs> I don't tell you, brother. Me, I don't tell you for Niger. Hello everybody, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much for watching. God bless you. If today is your first time, you are highly welcome. Please consider to subscribe, share, like our video, and turn on your IPOP leader Namdi Kanu, the High Court of Abia has barred security agents from denying members of the public access to any courtroom or court premises during the trial of the detained leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, Namdi Kanu. Justice Benson, in an order issued on Friday, November 19, 2021, also forbid security agents anywhere in the country from arresting observers during Kano's trial. Yes, so the Biafrans are heading somewhere. Initially, nobody is allowed to be in the courtroom or any of the court premises during Kano's trial. But now the court has gave them order to allow any observers access to the courtroom any time Kano trials is on the seats. This is really interesting. Welcome back to my channel. If today's your first time, you're welcome. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Like, share, and turn on your post notification. My returning viewers, thank you so much. If you're not seeing our videos as usual, YouTube has problem. Please unsubscribe and subscribe again. God bless you. What has Namdi Kano done? before he was arrested, absolutely nothing, compared to what the Fulani Esme and the Boko Arams are still doing, still doing. So this country and uh, injustice judgment, injustice treatment, some Nigerians have, some Nigerians, they, they treat them well, uh, first class citizens, especially when you come from the northern part of Nigeria, and especially when you be cow, the only people that the only people may get upper treatment or may, the government, they treat them as normal person. Now, Kawo, Fulani Esmen, Boko Haram, and the Northerners. I know say, some of the Northerners, they're against what is happening right now. No, be all of them automatically joined Buari or supported Buari for these killings and destructions in Nigeria. No. Many of them, they are against it completely. Just the way nobody, everybody supports Biafra Nation. So that is it. Not be everybody, they think alike or do the same thing. These treatments in Namdi Kano and Sunday Ubo, including Soware, it makes no sense because these people are just freedom fighters. They are just fighting for the good of the land, fighting for the benefits of the land, fighting for one Nigeria, fighting for us to enjoy all the natural resources Nigeria has produced. But some people are jack the country for a very long time. This is not the reason why people want to split. This is not the reason why everybody they fight for division, separation, so that we go know our bearings. It's just too much. The frustration in the land is too much. The the pains, it don't make sense now. Mama go just born three children. You go just like two out of three or like one out of the three. It's painful, not torture. You they torment the, the peace of the other people. The Biafrans, they live for this country since the existence of this nation. 
but it's just as if they have been abandoned for years. Nothing is happening in the land. Despite the fact that the most natural resources, the real natural resources, may they put this country in shape, the, our source of income is coming from the Biafra land. Or, and if you go that part of the Biafra land where this source of income they come from, Delta part, eh, the, that place is completely scattered. Nothing to show, say, this now where the whole year they comes from. The place is so, so condemned. Nothing to write about. Nigeria generally, nothing to write about the country. I just came back from Nigeria. Where I they stay, not the estate. You know, some place get light. Where the estate where I did light, they get 24 hours. But where my husband and I built hotel, that place... Light now only two hours in a day, a whole day, two hours. In many cases, one week, no light at all, at all. Which can contribute that somebody even came from Niger, can't stay for our hotel for a week. She was so shocked. She said, Now, Nigeria, they give them light for Niger and them get light 24 hours. Say, so Why we will not get light? I never see government give the Biafra's helping hand in the northern parts of Nigeria. But why the northerners go one rear their cattle? The government, federal government, go say, may all the governors give the acres of lands to rear their cattle. Which kind of injustice is this? Why we say the, the, the headsmen and the Boko Haram, they, they treat them more special. They treat them like VIPs, like the first class citizens candidates for the country why the other parts of nigeria especially the biafrans they they treat them like trash you know makes sense anyway this matter really tired me see the way i just they talk plenty i just they happy say at least the courts finally granted observers and the newsmen houses to courtroom and court premises anytime in the Kano trials is on. So that's one now. Uh, at least now victory. They are leading to somewhere. And heading to somewhere. Anyway my people might live enough for this place. I wish them success. I wish Nigeria success. Let there be peace. Unity. The sufferings is just too much. The hardship is extreme. People are suffering. That is the reason why they, they cry for division. We are one Nigeria for a very long time and nothing happened. And nothing will still happen as long as we get all these big, big thieves holding these thieves. People that they are age group, no day for life again. They still they rule us because they get privileged to stay alive. All our educated and talented youths, graduates, everybody don't become Yahoo. Because hold crook like this, no one rests and give the younger ones space. So problem will still continue like this. Division, everybody wants division, everybody wants separation. May they split the country if it's too big for one person to carry on as president. If not, people like Nam Dikanu, Soware and Sondebo will for no know if they, they exist at all. If everything 